fruitiest event on the Bulgarian festival calendar. It happens once a year in the town of Kostandil, which is situated southwest of the capital of Sofia, just next to the borders of Serbia and North Macedonia. The Cherry Festival Kostandil had arrived. And let me show you what happens over the three-day event. Day 1, Friday 24th of June, 6 p.m. They started with a little light entertainment. Beautiful bit of strings followed by poetry reading from one of the organizers. Ще сънува слънцето отново и в него и с него ще се природи. With intervals of a very talented young singer. Then, in the middle of the town, the, the stage was set for some deep house DJing all the way into the night. Day 2, Saturday, 25th of June, 10 a.m. All the small towns and villages that make up the municipality of Kirsten Dill set up their stalls with different and unique presentations of this wonderful sweet cherry. The theme of this year's event was the wheel, as you can probably see why. Cheris is one uh, out of the one out of the wonderful symbols of Houston Dill town and uh, area and region. Nobody knows when they came uh, here. Probably on the Roman time. Most of the scientists think that Cheris came from uh, Israel, Palestine, or Syria, but that is not really proof. Thirteen years ago, uh, Cheris became symbol of holiday of the town when uh, all culture houses and people who produce cherries are celebrating this sweet fruit in many forms, in many colors. Many people say be thin like cherry. If you eat many cherries, you become thinner. I think that uh, this uh, saying is not true because I'm eating a lot of cherries and it's um, only pretty, not just only, only pretty, yes, only you are. pretty. Yeah. I got experience of those 13 years participating in these holidays and every time uh, the holiday became richer, brighter, with more and more people and more and more fun. Let me say, except cherries, on our table there is a plum. Yeah, the green plums. Yeah, the That's green what my, my idea. Because I said our flag is uh, white, red, and green. One white, red, and green. And that's why we need um, three colors of our flag. Uh, and that is that is what the idea. And again, um, a green plum is a symbol of earth, green earth, earth, soil, which produce uh, those cherries. Kirsten uh, Dill, what percentage of the cherries to all the Not much as uh, he, he, he should, yes. yes. Not much. We can give 20% uh, of all cherries in uh, our country, but we give uh, less and less every year because uh, 
I said, and once I repeated, market is in development, in nothing they doing about it. This is my opinion. Yes. So did you say how many different varieties of cherries they have here? More than 100. More than 100 different yes. varieties. How can I say, Institute of Agriculture uh -huh. made those kinds just to produce uh, something different yes. to show on the market. Uh -huh. They are rarely produced in just in Europe. Uh -huh. Most uh, sorts are kinds are three, five to ten, but there are most more than hundred. I heard just, that. And, and again, when was the very first uh, cherry festival? What was the year of the cherry festival? Seven. Mm -hmm. They said more. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Pretty nice. I'm sorry, fifteen years. About sorry for that. Years, around fifteen years. Two thousand and seven. But was a good idea, yes. which was developed well, but um, most pur but the purpose of developing the market was failure. Right. I'm sorry to say that. No. Maybe someone opposed me, but um, I think like that. If you were also starting to feel a little bit peckish, there was a grill and a pizza stand. I assume tasted very good, as it was always a big queue there of people waiting. И тази година чере ще обсипа на състоят. Ните са добри, а нощите са топли. Всичко ти казва на берекете. Виж, и пчелата се е събудила. И да не чуе дявола, да не стане нещо до месец, до два, да пази Господ. Да срещнем Велик ден, да мине Георгиов ден. Старите ще събират съчки и ще подклаждат огъня. Да ни подкажи. Подкажи. Голямо правене на зимнина ще падне. Децата ще покача решовите листенца. Айде сега си го кажи ти на микрофончето и гледай на там. Ще гълтат череши с костилките. Ще тичат, ще викат с радостен глас. Честит празник Кюстендил! Честит празник Кюстендил! Благодаря! Това е пано, изкол пано. Това е Вилич Раждавица, когато сте тук. Това е тук, да? Да, да. Това е тук, да? Муниципалите гай. Ха-ха-ха-ха. Ако това е много талантът, хората, които са правили това. Това са хората, не? Това са хората. И неща за това. Ти казах, че са хората? Да, че са хората от Вилич. Да, от Вилич. Бам-бам-бам-бам! <laughs> then back to the stage for a concert of Custon Dill's youth performing traditional Bulgarian dances.
also fun for the kids. Drawing and colouring, face painting, and even learning how to write your favourite words in Chinese. So much fun for everyone, even the babas were updating their Facebook statuses. And of course, some poor. As it got to the late afternoon, the weather was not on our side as the storm blew in. We actually didn't make it down to the concert in the evening that had been planned. Day 3, Sunday, 26th of June, 10 a.m. All the stalls from the day before were full of many ideas and ways that you can introduce cherries into dishes and drinks. The paparazzi were on hand as the judges circled around all the stalls tasting and judging to make the decision which stall would be the winner. Everything from cakes, syrups, teas, even yogurt from the leaves of the cherry tree, pies, all sorts of sweet and savoury items were available to see, inspiring all who was there to use cherries in different ways. Well, I hope my video inspired you to visit this wonderful festival next year, or have you already been to it? Please let me know in the comments below. And if you're liking my videos from my channel, there are many ways you can help support them. One of the best ones is to hit that like button now. Another way is you can give a super thanks, which is the button just to the right of the thumbs up down below the video. You can also press join and become one of our members and get some special perks. Soon I'll have a recommendation video of a great place we were lucky enough to find when we were in Custom Dill during the festival. When that video is ready, it'll appear here. Until then, check out this other video of another beautiful Bulgarian town with an amazing festival, world famous. I look forward to seeing you over there on one of them.